how to repair. In this video I'm going to be showing you something different. How to build an automatic watering system using your old washing machine watering valves. And I'll teach you how to link it up with Alexa or Google Assistant or another tool. Hey Alexa, turn on the watering system. Okay. And there we go. The watering system has started and as you can see water's coming out. You're able to set this to a timer so it comes on for a few minutes a day to water your hanging baskets or you can actually set it via your mobile phone to come on when you're not at home and you can set up the watering system that way. Alexa, turn off the watering system. Okay. And this is just using old washing machine watering valves. Right, the Alexa system is connected to a smart socket. I'll put all the links on the website to these types of sockets. These can be paired with the actual Alexa device. This then controls a water valve which is inside the box which I keep both completely sealed to keep them out of the elements in case of heavy rain or anything else. So let's take a look inside. So here we are, we've got a standard switch. This one is actually hooked up to Alexa, but you could do it to Google Assistant, Siri, whoever you've got. I'll put all the links on the website to the good manufacturers of these. Uh, I use Sonoff now, I used to use a couple of other makes, but they failed over a period of time. Uh, this has been absolutely brilliant. This then takes a 240 volt supply, to the water valve and a water valve only needs a live and a neutral on each side of the valve. I've also earthed it to make sure it's safe and then you just take the water coming into the water valve, the same as your washing machine. From the water valve then it goes down, you can either take it to a hose pipe or you can take it through to a micro irrigation system. I'll put all the links on the page, this is at the bottom of the page or in the description on this video and this will take you through to all the micro irrigation and this can be connected up to all your potted plants, hanging baskets, ideal for things like uh, people who have a lot of potted plants in their garden or pubs that have hanging baskets and I'll show you the application now of what you can actually do with this. So here we have my mobile phone. I've got Amazon built into it. I've also got eWe Link, which is actually the smart devices. And as you can see, Water Garden is off at the moment. You've got manual settings where you can turn it on and you can hear the water valve coming on. You can turn it off and it turns the water valve off. You've also got schedule. This means at seven o'clock in the evening, it turns on, waters the pots um, for two minutes, then turns off. And at seven o'clock in the morning, it turns on and waters for two minutes and then turns off. You can set as many schedules as you need. You can set it up for any time of day and you can also override them. So if you're away on holiday and you know it's, horrible wet weather in Britain, why would you be watering the garden? So you can just turn it off. Absolutely brilliant, easy to use. You can set these up with all sorts of different devices. I'll be going through how to set them up with lighting. Uh, I've also got automatic cleaners that uh, clean the house and everything else. So I'll show you all that in later videos. So here we have one of the smart devices. These are all available on the website. I've put links to all of these. I like this one. I'm not going to say her name. I will do in a second because she listens to everything. But it's quite straightforward. Once you've got these integrated with your smart switches, you can use them for lighting, watering the garden, many other things. So I'm just going to start doing the garden now. Alexa, turn on the watering system. Okay. Now the garden is watering and after a couple of minutes, you might want to turn it off. Alexa, turn off the watering system. Okay. And that's it. Nice, easy. You can manage your garden from anywhere in the world 
with these smart devices. All the smart devices I'll put on the page with all the sockets uh, that are available. I'm only going to put the ones I like because I have had a couple of bad ones in the past and I'll put all the links to the special manifolds and the micro irrigation systems. So if you don't have a machine to scrap and you do need any water valves, we have them all on the website. You can buy new ones, but what we've just started now is a recycling plant. So you can get these water valves from about six, seven pounds second hand, and they're ideal for watering the garden using the irrigation system. The ones to buy are the ones with the spade connections, unless the wiring harness is with the old ones. There you go. Thank you very much indeed for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And please remember, you can all support the website by buying us a beer. Thanks for watching.